guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting ring to episode 11 of Slow Loops. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Uh oh are you okay mm -mm. You probably got car sick <laughs> so you've distracted yourself I I know, right? <laughs> oh god, I cannot believe the show is ending next week. I mean, really more of this week cuz of course this is coming out tomorrow, so cuz I was super busy this weekend and wasn't able to film this like Friday, Saturday, and today was the only day that I could get it done. But I'm sad. I mean, this, like I said in the beginning when I watched this, this did give me immediate feels to lay back camp. But, you know, instead of camping, it's fishing. And, I mean, the one thing that I also said, I remember saying that, oh, hey, the Kita Fantasy, a game that, you know, has every character made from the people who made the series and the countless others, they're all together. So, I mean, it's canon and they all get to see each other and stuff. But then, you know, the greatest anime that is also made by the same people is coming officially back in April. And I'm super excited because my babies, I've missed them so much. But at the same time, I'm really going to miss this as well. Because even though it doesn't feel like the end, it's only episode 11. But when we get to Friday, it, it's going to feel weird not having this on anymore hearing this song like oh my god I, <laughs> i'm probably gonna cry on friday after i come home from work and be like all right time to watch this <laughs> and cry oh <laughs> i feel like this is gonna make excuse me, majorly be a Koi, Koi and Hiyori focus episode. Hmm? Mm, yeah. <laughs> Oh, so cute! Hmm? <laughs> mm hmm? How about we just call it all girls camping trip? Like, <laughs> <laughs> or 
or just straight up girls trip. <laughs> Hey. <laughs> I mean, hey, it's five o'clock somewhere. It's time to drink. You do what you gotta do. Uh, okay, Koharu. Sure. Oh my god, it was just part of what she had to do, babe. Mm-hmm. You're basically asking her if she gets jealous. Futaba always has fun with you. Oh no, don't cry.
Yeah. Being anyone's best friend can be heavy sometimes. Especially when you fight with them. But you only fight with them because you love them. They're so cute. I swear to God, if we don't get a spinoff series on Aiko and Futaba older, I'm suing. Yes, ma'am. What's wrong, Koharu? Yeah, you got this. for no It's cute though. Look, it's good. Nice job. Never had hot wine. Mm. You know, maybe if one of y'all had a car. <laughs>
Things are cute. It's so early in the morning. That or more like a girlfriend. Yeah. So before that, you two really weren't that close, but still, we take care of each other, though. Hmm. Oh. It's those fucking big girlfriends. Big girlfriends! <laughs> they always big girlfriends. Help, in a way, they've always been inseparable like this. Oh, they were thinking the same thing! Oh. Yeah, so don't blame yourself.
No! <laughs> of course. Of course, it's something about Hiori. Yeah, the, the fish when they were kids and the cloud. Oh my god, that looks like a bunny. See, look at her. Once again, best girl material. I love her so much. I will miss her so damn much. So we pray that when they, they officially, because see, they're going to make me end up playing Kira Fantasia again. And because see, that always happens when, um, when laid back camp officially started, like a few years ago, I was, I was still playing the game. Then I stopped playing. But when the demon girl next door started, oh, I started playing the game again. <laughs> so something tells me in the next few weeks, I'm probably going to end up like downloading the game again and playing it again from the beginning, even though I can't like... I never saved my data. <laughs> so I hope, you know, we get to see these girls again. Hell, I'm still hoping that, you know, one day they do a anime adaptation of the Kira Fantasy game. So that you get to see all the girls and different characters from so many different vast animes that these two creators have created together. And so many freaking different animes and magazines that they've done so hopefully we are praying one day but this was a really good episode focusing on koi and hiyori i loved the flashback initially where she you know to start to call her went before that calling her yamihi and then going to hiyori and just how good their relationship has been up till now yeah they probably weren't always as close but they still love and care for each other they've always been there for each other no matter what and it's sweet and, and still once again i'm sad next week is the last damn episode or really this week but sometimes it's just time for something to end you know and there's nothing you can really do about that like, don't get me wrong, I would love to see, like, a second season for this to come, but, um, I feel like, th this is the one thing I'll say about this show. This show had, like I said, comparing it to the similarity of Laid Back Camp, it is similar to it, 100%, but there are some things that are different between Laid Back Camp and this. I don't think this show got as big as possibly maybe you know the company who animated this um wanted it to do it got popular and they were very happy that it got popular hell probably got a lot of people into fishing by the end of it but for it to get a second season i'm not really sure on that i i don't think it did the necessary precautions or reach those certain goals that laid back camp did to get the same season, uh, another season, or how, look at freaking New Game, which is also by the same people who, who did this and stuff, or, um, I'm trying to think of something else, there's like, uh, Sakura Trick, which only got one season, um, how, The Demon Girl Next Door, look at that show, and how that one wasn't really as, The Demon Girl Next Door was hella popular, we all know it was, um, especially depending on who was watching it and stuff, but I remember, like, specifically for me, like, 
my my ratings for it I, I think it was like a hit or a miss it just depends it did get hits and stuff but I already knew like a lot of people were gonna watch the crap out of it I think one because of a catching opening a catchy opening and everything else this has a very good catchy opening but like I mean if it gets a chance to get a second season of course I'll be there watching it because this was such a really good educational show hell I'm talking like this is the last damn episode but I mean if it does, it does. If it doesn't, I am really satisfied and okay with it being 12 episodes and going to have the chance to get back and like to rewatch it because the show was just really adorable and wholesome and cute. It's just, you know, once again, the cute girls do cute things. And of course, the thing was fishing. And it just really depended on the end of the day how the audience was really going to like it, plus merch sales and everything else. But seriously, an episode focusing on Hiyori and Koi's relationship. I think this is now officially my number one favorite. I mean, you know, any episode that focuses on Koi because she's best girl and I love her. She's just fucking, like, very zen, very mellow, and I fucking love her and I will miss her so freaking much godly next week. <laughs> it's gonna be so weird when we get to this last episode next week. But yeah, I really personally enjoyed this a lot. I thought the girls' trip was adorable and sweet. Um... Futaba's friend getting jealous of Hyori, that's fucking adorable. I mean, it happens hell in regular animes and boys love animes and girls love animes. It happens all the time. So, of course, it just it needed it. It was just so cute. It's so, it's just so freaking adorable to see it happen. And I'm like, oh, baby. And of course, seeing the fact is even like Koi possibly got jealous of Koharu, but probably not as much. She doesn't have like her way of showing it as much as Futaba's friend. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 11 of Slow Loop. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially on Friday for the final episode. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye!